they go to their unofficial prom. KMUH's Destiny Patterson tells us how parents still made prom happen despite the school's decision to cancel it. Corsages are on their wrists and boutonnieres are on their lapels tonight in Centralia. I've gone to prom before and this is just something totally different and unique. Earlier this month, Centralia High School announced there wouldn't be a prom this year due to COVID-19. But Centralia parents took matters into their own hands. They are providing an opportunity that the school could not provide. So they had to fill out a, a, a plan, uh, propose it to the health department for approval. Kelly Whelan's daughter Delaney is actually a senior at Paris High School. So when she asked to go to Centralia's unofficial prom with her boyfriend, Whelan couldn't help but say yes. They shop early, they get dresses, they get invited, they have fancy promposals. She's had some other things in her life that she couldn't have closure on and I felt like it was going to hinder her in her future to not have closure. Meanwhile, other parents are worried about their children's safety. And if they don't feel like it's safe, definitely make the choice that your child should not come. Many students went to the picturesque Chance Gardens for their prom photos, but no one wore masks and there was very little social distancing. We want to make sure it's done safely. City Mayor Chris Cox says they're doing everything they can to make sure it's safe. They've set up markers, talked about cars and vehicles, they've blocked up the square. For several reasons, tonight will be one to remember for Centralia juniors and seniors. In Centralia, Destiny Patterson, KOF.